came out with the mindset of just playing hard and playing together. That's 48 minutes, so, uh, you know, it came out with a win, so we just got to continue to do that each and every game so we get to the playoffs. Milwaukee was up 29-20 late in the first quarter when Stan started sprinkling you guys in, and that's mm-hmm. kind of when games have gotten away the last few mm-hmm. games. Mm-hmm. What was it? You had Stanley with that second unit tonight. How, was it, was it a, a different composition just led to different results tonight? From um, You know, obviously Stanley brings the toughness and, um, you know, ath- uh, athleticism, so, you know, that, that possibly could have helped. But I think as a group, we all, you know, want to come in and, and, you know, play as hard as we can and go for 48 minutes. We had these lows where sometimes it's the second unit, sometimes it's the first unit, and we're not putting it together for wins. So um, I think we all had an awareness to come in and just play hard and then leave it all on the floor and just see what happens. Does this maybe clear the air and allow you guys to refocus? Um, well, we got a lot of work to do. Um, you know, we're still trying to get to the playoffs, so we're trying to take each game at a time. But uh, maybe get a monkey off your back just a little bit, but monkey might come back. So we got to keep, you got to keep playing and uh, just just leave it out, all, leave it all out there on the floor, and then you know let the rest take care of itself. You know, your instinct is when you get it in there, you're looking to, to pass. Mm-hmm. But you have, but it, it, it Stan said that you've been encouraged to, to take the shot when it's there. Is that is that something you have to learn? Um, no, that always feels good. You know, if I get the opportunity, I'll you know try to try to get a shot up. But I, you know, I'm more of a you know pass first type of guy. And like try to find my guys out there. So you know, sometimes they get frustrated with me. Sometimes you know people tell me to shoot or whatever. But um, you know, Stan came with me after the uh, after one practice, a couple maybe a month ago, or two months ago. Just said I like that you're you know trying to trying to score. You know, that always feels good. You know, for to hear that. So you know, he has confidence in me. Then you know. Maybe I'll go up with a couple more shots and get an easier shot. Does a game like this, uh, in light of that, obviously games will dictate whatever the situation is, but does a game like this where you have such success scoring the basketball that efficiently, does that, will that maybe you know, light a spark for you to be looking for your shot a little bit more moving forward? I just, I don't go too out of character. You know, I do my job and I try to do it as well as I can. Um, you know, if I got it, you know, I'll try to do it, but I'm not going to just, you know, try to break people down and use my speed and stuff. I mean, I'll take what I, what I, what I, what I feel like I got. So um, hopefully I'll keep learning and keep letting the game slow down to me and uh, just try to figure it out. The first career double-double, career highs in points and rebounds has to feel good. Oh uh, yeah, that feels good. Um, I don't, I don't know what I finished with yet, but I know I got double-double now. Thanks to you. Uh, uh, <laughs> uh, oh yeah, appreciate it. Yeah, yeah that feels good. Six assists, triple double there, huh? <laughs> I, mean, I need a triple double. I made my first. Man, come on, coach. Yeah, let me, let me in. Nah, but yeah, it feels good, and I'm just happy we came out with a win. Thank you. Thank you.